wait for them to come around, and we'll see them see battle. Like, get in direction, Mike. I'll drift. Yeah, I'm just gonna build cars. <laughs> My build cars. We are fucked. We're, no, we're, we're, we're fired. That's it. We're done. That's it. Is there fluid? Mm -hmm. yeah. So find a piece of cardboard. <laughs> I mean, I mean I, this isn't fucking FD. I know we, we're not allowed to do that. I don't think they would notice. They wouldn't notice, but you're not allowed to do that. Go, 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 And Bill Perron needs to start applying the pressure, starts gaining proximity as they head into the second half of the course. Nice off by Matt Pollock. Now as Bill Perron really needs to apply the pressure, Bill oh, straight and two tires off towards the exit. Big mistake by Bill Perron pushing through with that turbocharged V10 and Ben Williams kicking it back and starting to, there you go, now he's really applying the pressure. There you go, Ben Williams, but no, spinning out right before the finish. Oh, man. Viper motor. So Ben Williams doing a good job of keeping things tidy so far. Bill Perron keeping a conservative distance behind him. Could be dink for an inactive Jace, but we'll see. As Ben Williams still on the track, still going in the right direction. Bill Perron really could. Oh, but Ben Williams spinning out in the same spot as he did on his follow run.